Well, hello there, Dukely here. We're back playing Rise of Flight. This is a new test pilot. This is absolutely massive on the inside. This is a Felix Stowe um, F5, I believe it is. Or is it an F4? One or the other. Um, anyway, let's have a look at this beast. Look at this. It is absolutely massive. It is lovely wood paneling. Uh, it's a fantastic model. Um, it's very clean looking. I love the wood. It's well done. Uh, you got a gunner there on the top. You got a guy in the side there who can, I believe, uh, flip back and forth uh, with his little gun and shoot at either side. We've got a guy in the front here. Got myself uh, and the flying uh, seat. Um, this carries a bomb. Uh, two of them, I believe. Yeah, two bombs. Uh, it probably has more, maybe? I don't know. Um, that's what it is, after all. It's a bomber. Uh, you know, it's very large. Massive. Now, I've decided I will give you more information historically about each craft when we go to, um, let me just put my second engine down here, um, when we go to test pilot. So, I can tell you right off that this was powered by two 350 horsepower Rolls-Royce Eagle sevens, I believe, um, which was a 12-cylinder V-piston engine. Um, this aircraft can do uh, 88 miles an hour, uh, thereabouts, and it can go 6,800 feet up, uh, and it can fly for about seven hours. Um, let's see, what else we got here? We got uh, one Lewis Gun flexible mount in nose position. Yeah, well, ours has two on it, I think. Yeah. Um, we got another one, uh, each of three midship positions. Uh, under rack wings provide right, for four 230 pound bombs. Now, I could probably have changed the loadout in the hangar, but we didn't. Um, let's see. This was designed in Britain. It's an English aircraft. And uh, eventually, I guess they exported some to the uh, United States Navy, who used a different power plant. Um, anyway, enough yammering. Let's unpause, because I just paused it for some reason. Let's. Let's fire it up, first of all. Let's have a look at the, at the engines. They don't sound very good. Alright, so, here we go, we're moving. It's basically like being in a boat. Um, I'm leaning quite heavily to the right here. I'm hoping that that's not... that is... oh boy. I'm hoping there's enough room to take off here. Why am I leaning so hard to the right? Okay, it's all right. We're up. We're going up. Um, it's got great airspeed. My God, it hauls ass. It takes right off, unlike the uh, the Hanley Page, which lumbers along for about 45 years uh, before you can actually do anything. So it appears we're in Dover, near Folkestone. Uh, Folkestone. Folkestone. And um, it's very white. A lot of lovely, lovely white cliffs. Let's go ahead and give it a little check of its uh, ability to turn. Jar it violently to the right. Um, probably be good if I stayed in the cockpit position so I could see what I was doing. There we go. Oh, it's lovely. It's a fantastic plane. No guns on it myself, of course. Um, apparently there is... Well, there was a ship out there that we could attempt to bomb. So this is V for the bomb site, of course. We're pressing B to drop some bombs when the time comes for that. I'm going to go ahead and go up a bit, since we're headed straight into the cliffs of Dover. I assume the English want to keep those white, so I'll stop um, myself from driving into them and ruining them with all the blood of my fellow flying people. My fellow airmen. Um, let's let's give this town a bomb. How about that? We'll give them, drop a couple bombs in the town here. Uh, the thing with the bombers, there's not a lot to do with them. I mean, we could fly into the, uh, into the dogfight zone, see how we do there. I'm sure we won't do well. Um, so let's go ahead and... Boop, 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 boop. They're very small bombs. Oh, oh, shit, I took out a whole block of housing. So that, 
That seems like a waste. I could carry a lot more bombs than that. So it's basically just two bombs and I'm done now? Like, I fly all the way there and, and I actually missed with one of them. <laughs> um, I don't know, you just think they would carry more bombs. Like I said, perhaps the hangar has a different loadout that you can choose from. So we're going to go ahead and fly. Uh, also, another thing to mention is it flies real straight. I mean, it goes up a bit. But uh, otherwise, we can go straight along here. We're going to go right across. Uh, I'm going to slow down because I need to make an adjustment. Because it has turned to the right. There we go. But yeah, it's built very much like a boat would be. Uh, and then they kind of just made a cross between a boat and an aircraft, a seaplane. That's what it was, after all. And, uh, you know, it's interesting that I, I didn't want to put it on autopilot. It's not that. I wanted to just fly it straight forward. Taking me off course now. Okay. There we go. Now we're flying straight forward. So we'll continue flying forward here. And we're going to get attacked by hostile aircraft. We're hoping. I think it would be quite funny to be attacked by hostile aircraft in this airplane. Oh, of course. Mm, might make it troubling. I usually attempt to land after. Uh, so let's have a look around. Do you see any hostile aircraft? Make sure my icons... Okay, they are on. You entered the dogfight zone. So there's not a whole lot I can do here. We're going to just make sure that the gunners have open fire. Uh, here comes the aircraft now. It's a sock with camel. Excellent. Uh, see if my guys begin opening fire. We are taking hits for sure. Get them, fellas. Get them. Oh, look at that. Magnificent shooting by Jeremy. Good shot, Jeremy. Oh, shit, he's gonna be my blind spot. I'm assuming that directly behind me is a bit of a blind spot. Oh, no, I have a gunner there, don't I? But, uh, he's gotta be very careful not to hit the tail surfaces. Get him. Take him down. I'm actually gonna have to turn uh, around here because we're gonna leave the zone. Look at this expertly turned aircraft, seaplane, what have you. I'm going to go ahead and get it on a level flight again if I can. There we go. We're on a level flight. Go ahead, do your worst, sir. Do your worst. Oh. Oh. That seems bad. I don't think smoke's supposed to be coming out of that. Sir. My gunner been killed? No, he's alright. Keep firing, asshole! Keep firing, assholes! Why have you stopped shooting? You're out of ammo. Is he too high up? Is he in a blind spot? What's happened? Why aren't you shooting? Shoot some more. I'm nervous. Oh, there's actually two little propellers there. What are those? Hmm. Oh, he's right there. Get him! Get him! He's just... I don't know how he hasn't shot me down yet. I mean, it must be my gunner keeping him at bay. Ooh, shots are bouncing off stuff. We've left the dogfight zone. Oh, I didn't want to leave the dogfight zone. He's still chasing me, however. Let's see if we can get him. Get out of here! Where's he gone? He's continuing pursuit. Come, come at me. Oh, oh, he's got he's got some smoke there now. Black smoke it looks like. Not a very good color. Mine's just white, which means my I forget what that's called. Um, uh, it's a type of uh, something in the engine that uh, when it leaks like that is really bad. Um, which means it's basically gonna catch fire at some point. Um, however. I think he might be leaving because we are headed back towards the... Yes, he's fallen behind. He's left. So we're going to go ahead and... Um, I'm going to go ahead and attempt to land here. Um, 
I don't know if landing in the harbor is something that I want to do, or I think you guys want to probably want to see me attempt to land in the harbor. Um, from this direction, I'm going to go ahead and get real low to the ground now, and then I'm going to pull up and burn off airspeed. And then I am going to kill off my... Actually, I might not need to burn off the airspeed at all. It's going down pretty quickly. I'm going to go ahead and drop the throttle ever so slightly, ever so slightly. Even more slightly than that. Even more. i just waiting. Uh-oh. What's wrong with it? Uh-oh. Um. Can I get a turn around here? Oh, that one engine is not doing well. Oh, oh god. Um. Okay. <laughs> uh. Oh! Rudder, 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 rudder! Oh no! The trees! Ah. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm actually alright. Oh no. Oh, I'm a little hurt. Okay. Let's have a check. Is everyone alive? Guy in the door. <laughs> he might be dead. No, he's fine. He's fine. He's fine too. That guy? Is the guy in the front alright? You alright there? Yeah, he's good. We're, we're alright. We landed. So that did more damage than I thought. It didn't actually uh, start to affect me until we were slowing down. Um, yeah, this is a fun aircraft. Uh, if you're looking to buying this one, on sale right now on riseofflight.com, I think is what it's called. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching. Uh, follow me on Twitter. And um, yeah, on Twitter. Follow me there. Oh, and uh, if you go to my game fan shop, which is a link on my main channel page, you can buy games for me for cheap and they're great so you should go there and check that out um anyway enough for the shameless plugs thank you for watching and i'll see you next time goodbye